Savannah Scott, uh, all your points are from downtown. Did you feel like, I mean, is that kind of your, your gig too, though, to shoot three pointers? Um, well, I just like, I hit the, fir or hit the first one, and then I just like was feeling it, and then our team was just hitting them, so it's just like rubs off of each other, so I felt the hot hand. Um, 11, I'm assuming, is a career high in points. Uh, you know, I, I mean, you're three for four shooting, and probably give exactly the boost that that uh, Cammy's been looking for. Uh, more points from guards. Do you feel like you're kind of getting into a rhythm mm -hmm. and so forth with more playing time? Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely like feeling more comfortable and like under control and just like, just like back to like my game. Okay. Kylie, you remain high. In fact, the same thing. You're four for seven and all of your uh, shots were from three point range. Um, you have to hit one to really feel it or maybe two? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I felt like today we had did a really good job of um, we had a lot of penetration and then kicking it out after that and we were just so open that I and mean, I mean we came out hitting them. I think we had four players in double digits today. Courtney hit a few. Uh, Scotty hit a few. And uh, I mean it's it's just all that penetration, you know, drawing the defense in and kicking it out to the open people. Um, I mean I I know you'd like to have that 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 touch and that feeling, but. Along with that, it just have that kind of a good look every night. And I, I'm assuming you know the looks were as good as they've been uh, in, in a while. Um, do you feel even like that's coming around in terms of you know just not even hesitating or having to think about when you're when you're out there and you've got a decent look and just just putting it up and you know making something happen? Yeah, for sure. Um, Coach E talks to us a lot about um, shot selections and what's a good shot and what's not. And I felt like um, a little bit there, especially in the first half, we were taking some early threes and kind of trying to live on the three. And then uh, Coach E talked to us about making sure that we got a dribble penetration or got a post touch before we mm -hmm. shot those threes. And like I said before, I think that just sucks the whole defense in. And then you just have that much more space and that much more time to get your shot off. It's got to feel good if either one of you can answer this. You know, we get two in a row at home, kind of get off the schneid a little bit. And um, especially after a crummy game last Saturday, uh, and not only beat a team that I think you know you should beat, but to beat them soundly, does that even say a little bit more about uh, you know where you're at right now? Yeah. Well, it feels good. Um, just like we're just, Coach E talk, talked about us about like turning the corner, and mm -hmm. so like like and playing the whole forty minutes and. Like we've been playing like 20 minutes of games or like just like taking those like four minutes off or whatever. And like, so if we just like play consistent the whole game, then then we're good. How much of a different feeling emotionally and mentally do you have than from a week ago after that game against North um, Florida? It's a whole different <laughs> feeling. I mean, obviously it feels good to get two uh, wins at home. We're gonna, we got a tough road trip, I mean, we're in a position where we're going to need to pick up some road wins. Right. Um, so it, it feels good, but we can't dwell on it. I mean, we got to come in tomorrow already focused and ready for next weekend because we got to we got to show up on the road. And we can't have, um, you know, a lag in the second half like we did tonight. You know, like we got to come out the full 40 minutes, especially when we're on the road, and just have sharp execution. Okay. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.